Choose your seat carefully on your next flight to minimize your exposure to flu. Pick a window seat that is close to the front or back of the aircraft. Why? Germs are spread through human activity and movement, and a study observed that people in these areas had the least amount of contact with other passengers. Traveling can be hectic, and airplanes are very dry, so it's easy to forget to drink enough water. Alcoholic drinks will further contribute to dehydration. Ask for water anytime the beverage cart comes by. Drink at least four to eight ounces of water for every hour in the air. Hand washing reduces the number of germs on your hands and prevents them from spreading to your eyes, nose, and mouth. If you're too far from a sink or want to avoid the airplane laboratory, hand sanitizer is a good second choice. It should be at least 60% alcohol to be effective. Pack smart with a flu reliever like Oscillococcinum by Boron. This homeopathic medicine works best when taken at the first sign of flu-like symptoms such as body aches, headache, fever, chills, and fatigue. No water is necessary as the sweet tasting pellets simply melt under the tongue. The TSA friendly individual doses are compact and can be tucked away in your carry-on. Even if you practice the best hygiene, the flu will always remain a travel hazard. If you do find yourself sick with symptoms of a flu-like illness, stay home until you are fever-free for at least 24 hours. I'm Ken Redcross with your Dr. Redcross to the Rescue Health Minute.